It's the Crypto Lightsaber back with another video, guys. We're going to talk about Elmo Inu, which is another meme coin. It's the second meme coin today that we're going to talk about. Uh, but I want to hammer something home about meme coins, right? Because we're talking about this in the Telegram chat, right? When it comes to meme coins, in my opinion, I've always said it, right? It's all down to marketing, right? Marketing and community, actually. Right? Without marketing or without community, they really don't stand a chance, right? Um... It could be the worst name. It could be the worst name meme coin you've ever heard of. Um, you know, we've seen it in you know when the whole market was serious and people first heard of meme coins. They, nobody took them seriously, right? But when you had competent teams that were doing just crazy marketing, right, and people are making millions on meme coins, right, people started to take notice. What you, the problem we have now is people think they could just come out with a meme coin and literally not do any marketing and expect it to pump in a bear market, right? It's not going to happen. Okay, guys, I want to give you an example of Squid Grow. Now, the video is on Elmo, right? So we're going to get into that. Um, they are doing marketing, which is what I like about it, right? We're going to talk about that in a minute. But if we look at Squid Grow, right? So this is the four-hour chart. I talked about Squid Grow, uh, Squid Grow sorry, um, about a month or so ago, right? It was way over here. Right, way over here in the beginning stages, right? But since then, it's just been going nuts, right? Now, you would think that a token that's named itself kind of similarly to a, 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 a token that rugged, right? The Squid Game token that was all over YouTube, all over social media. You know, that thing rugged. There's been a meme created out of it. Um, you know, the Squid Game token rugged. They ran off with, I don't know if it was hundreds of millions or billions of dollars. I, I'm not sure, right? But um, these guys... Squid Grow, choosing that name, I think it's a terrible name, but it doesn't really matter about the name. They've been marketing it, and they've got a community, and this thing is shooting to the moon even as we speak. All right, guys, so it just goes to show, right? If you can market a meme coin correctly, it's going to pump. Okay, guys, so with Elmo Inu, just before we get into it, right, like what I like about it is the fact that they've got some kind of marketing going on. We got some evidence of that right here. Okay, guys. So the most mentioned meme tokens in the last 24 hours, uh, Elmo Inu is in the top three. Okay, guys. This is amongst things like MicroPets, KateCoin, um, Elon Gate, right? Floki Inu, right? The most mentioned meme coins in the last 24 hours. And these guys have not even been out. I don't even think they've been out 24 hours yet. Right? If we look at the chart. Let's check out the chart, right? So this actually launched, oh yeah, it has been out 24 hours. This actually launched on the 19th of July. It's been going It's been going sideways, right? But um, it's starting to look like it's gonna get some movement, okay? I know that there is a marketing rollout. Uh, this is a sponsored video, by the way. And at the end of the day, right? I like meme coins that do marketing. That's what it's all about, right? It's all about marketing. Right? If you're getting into a meme coin and they're not doing any sponsored videos, they're not reaching out to influencers, they're not you know, getting Twitter calls and Telegram calls and things like that, then why are you even bothering with that meme coin, right? Elmo are doing that. So that is a plus straight away, right? So with Elmo Inu, if we looked at nothing else but the marketing, right, we say that this is potentially bullish, okay, guys? So if we look at uh, the website, Right, you can see like this is based on a Sesame Street character, Elmo. Right, so what is Elmo Inu? It's the world's hottest meme coin dedicated to the mission of providing value to investors by supporting charities that benefit the well-being of children to pay homage to the great philanthropic work that Sesame Street has done for children globally. You know that Sesame Street is you know, well involved with the hospitals and, st and, and stuff. Over here in the UK, we have children in need. I think Sesame Street plays a similar role in the United States and so on. So Elmo Inu is the world's first Sesame Street meme coin dedicated to the mission of providing value to investors by supporting charities that benefit the well-being of children to pay homage to the great philanthropic work that Sesame Street has done for children globally okay guys so they've got a theme okay they're not just calling it elmo just for the sake of it right and um, they've got a theme you know this is a charitable token right they're going to be donating to orphanages um in pakistan and things like that all right guys now we've seen meme coins come out in the past that said they're charitable and they weren't um this one comes from a good source okay so um you know take that however you want it 
but um, you know we, we have to see whether they you know uh, whether they live up to those standards right um, you're gonna be able to buy Elmo with GPay and Apple Pay and a credit card okay so um, they're gonna be implementing that sort of thing uh, to make this more accessible to you know people that want to buy it okay guys influencer marketing campaign that's what we want to see okay guys um, like I said, it's all about marketing in my opinion and then build their global presence and so on So they've got quite an extensive roadmap here. You can have a look in your own time um, So, you know uh, with me all I want to see is marketing. Okay, and um, these guys are doing it So that for me is a good thing. So the team of course is not fully docs You can see um, their avatars here, but they are KYC. Okay guys um, so they have a KYC uh, certificate that you can have a look at over here so you guys can check out the documents in your own time so um hopefully you know these guys are going to be true to you know because, because you're seeing people getting kyc'd and audited with people like certic nowadays right we saw there was a rug and um, that happened i think sometime yesterday and people were talking about the fact that you know they were audited by certic and all that sort of stuff i said you know what a certain audit doesn't really mean much nowadays. Everyone's going about, going on about audits and stuff. They've been going on about that stuff for a long time, but ultimately we've seen a lot of audited and KYC projects rug, and um, I don't even know if their DLs ever get released. But um, with Elmo Enu, it seems to have something's going for it. Okay, um, it's audited by Gempad. If you know who Gempad is, uh, the chart is looking pretty good at the moment. Uh, it's very low market cap as well, sitting at 121k. So um, yeah, it is high risk at the end of the day. It's going to be a volatile asset. So please don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. Do your own research, all right, guys. The buy and sell taxes are around 10%, 10% in. I think it's 10% in, 10% out. But you know the the sell tax, you might want to um, up it to 12%. All right, guys. The tokenomics are on here as well. So um, I do recommend you de you delve into the FAQs and um, it will basically answer quite a few questions for you over here and then what you can do is jump into the telegram and then you know these guys will be able to answer any questions you've got in over here so it's got a pretty loaded community at the moment 5,841 members so they're doing their thing to grow the community and that's what it's all about so we'll have to see whether this one pays off at the end of the day Sometimes it's just about waiting, all right, guys. Um, they say it's not about timing the market; it's about time in the market, all right, guys. But it's also it's also good to know when to buy, and when to sell. Um, you don't want to be holding something too long, in my opinion. If they're not doing marketing, um, it's probably you know a good sign for you that you know they're probably not worth you know waiting out on. Um, but you just never know with mean coins. Sometimes they just come through, all right, guys. So with Elmo Inu. I think it's a good look. I think it's got potential. So uh, we'll see how it goes. Um, yeah, had a bit of a rant in this one. But um, yeah, it had to be said. All right, guys. So do me a favor and subscribe to the channel. Tick the little bell for notifications. Let's see if Elmo Inu can take us to the moon. We'll see. I'll see you guys in the next video.